finger hurts like a bitch, dude. Yeah, you're a bitch. You're a fucking bitch. And we're live. Oh, <laughs> welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another WTG episode, podcast episode. Derek, how's your day been? I've been doing all right, so. I broke my pinky earlier playing basketball, but other than that, I've been pretty well. I've been uh, living life. Hey, niggas was getting injured left and right all day. Yeah, today was today was a bad day for basketball. Some nigga got his, he had to go get his eye stitched because he got his shit cut up. Some nigga tore his MCL and his ACL at the same time. Basketball is actually really I dangerous broke my pinky. for amateurs. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like professionals don't get injured as much. Yeah, no, but, um, uh, um, well, no, I thought, I don't know why, I don't know why, no, no. <laughs> you fucking retarded, man. <laughs> How you interrupt my complete sentence with your fucking stutter speech? <laughs> Look, I have a, like, I have a clear, you know, impasse on my, my, my sentence. Your You're as like, oh, yes. uh, well, so let me stop you there and stutter. What the fuck? <laughs> what very that? true, very true, very true. No, but, um, but yeah, no, it, it, basketball is, it has a lot of potential to be a very dangerous sport because niggas be flying at fast paces. Yeah. To be jumping up in there when niggas go for a dunk, you play with the wrong nigga. That when you go for a dunk, if he hits you the wrong way, you out for. I mean, you shouldn't be dunking on niggas anyways. Like, yeah, you this should. This is a respect thing, you know. What I'm Derek, if you could dunk, you'd be. You would, yeah, you, I'm Derek, a dunk. You would be everybody. the most disrespectful nigga yes, with it. You know that. I know but that. Look, so look. what the fuck are you talking about? Look, Just because you can't dunk. Look, I can dunk if I lose some weight, but that's the harder part. You know, like I, I got the muscle for it. I just don't got the weight. You know, mm-hmm. it's hard to lift fucking two hundred pounds all the way up. What it's like eleven feet, ten feet, ten feet. Yeah, it's hard to do that. You feel me? So I, I could dunk, but like it's disrespectful. Like you know how niggas back in the day in the old school shit, they bounce the ball off your head, nigga. You know what I'm like, <laughs> yeah, like, those street balls like, when they. Were, <laughs> like, that's, that's, that's out of the rules of basketball now. You know what I'm saying? Like, like and that's pretty much unguardable. You feel me? Like, what, what what can you do when a ball that's coming at your face when it's not supposed to be? You know? And yeah, and then and then he does like some he does some like cool shit too, where he does that shit, and then yeah, then he crosses you, and you mm-hmm, already look just destroys you. The Knicks don't even really cost you. Like, you got hit with a fucking basketball. You got like a minor concussion and shit. You just you're Off. disoriented. Like, even on a rebound, bro, when I get hit with the basketball in the face by accident, you know, trying to catch it, like, yeah, I, like, I get so, like, cut off guard. Bro. Yeah, like, what the fuck are you supposed to do? Like, like it just, because you're not even, like, because you can't be, like, because then everybody's like, oh, you all right, you all right? And it's like, I'm all right, nigga, just keep playing the game, because the ball's still in play just because it hit you off the head doesn't mean shit. Yeah. And it's like, right. so. It's like, fuck them niggas, bro. They get real disrespectful. I don't feel like watching this whole video. Just give me what I want. Niggas just get disrespectful. Oh, let's see. Yeah, like, I don't know. But if I'm dunking, I'm, I'm putting nuts. To fucking top the head, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I'm making sure you 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 know that you just got shit it all. Like I can have two points that game as long as I dunked on you once, bro. I won, you know. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Especially if there's people there to watch, because like if nobody's there to watch and you dunk on somebody, okay, that's cool. But like if there's like a crowd of people there and you have everybody go, oh, yeah, like like this right here. Like how are you? Here we go, for, go ahead, full screen this real quick. But it's like how are you supposed to? This is the bone collector. This is a while ago, so the quality is not gonna be the best. But like, who's the bone collector? He's uh he's like a basketball dude that uh just does a lot of crossovers and shit like that. Mm-hmm. But like, like what like how are you? What are you supposed to do with that when that shit just bounces off your fucking head? And then you get saw, and then you have to like, what are you supposed to do? Like I that's like, sad. Look, like you know? and then bop. Like what? Like that's Manny Pacquiao. Like I'm like the man. <laughs> nigga just did this to Manny Pacquiao, a yeah, boxer. This, You're gonna this, get your ass knocked out. Nigga, like. What are you supposed to do with that? There's nothing. Shoot a nigga. Like, come on. Like, <laughs> like really, though. Like, because that was uncalled for. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, because if you, if you like, catch it, then you have goat reflexes, and you're like, you're like, you're like cool shit for a minute. And then, you know, turn over, and that's nice. But, like, if you, you don't catch it, then you're just like, boo-boo the fool. Yeah, you look stupid. Like, it's like when nigga, like, when the floor is slippery, and you fall, and nigga, they, they cross you. <laughs> like, no, like, like you, it makes you want to stop. Like, you know, time out. Look, look. Test the floor. It's obviously slippery right here. You know, like, my nigga, when he steps on your foot and then he like like kind of jolt back. Bro, I fucking hate push offs. Like, like a motherfucker. Like no, not even a push off. But like if you like, especially you, you've done this to me one time when you're in the when you're in the uh, paint. the paint and you're backing me up and then you step on my shoe, but you don't do it on purpose. You step on my shoe and then back me up and I fall <laughs> and then you put that shit up and then you go, oh baby, baby. <laughs> I go, no, my nigga, no, no, you did not baby nobody. You stepped on my fucking no, shoe. No, no, no. Should have kept your footing, nigga. You I did kept my footing. You stepped on my footing. That's what that. Was, look, look, you invaded my look. shit. 
I had my life figured out. You came and fucked it up. That's nah. what happened. See, the thing That's I my hate... motto. Figure your life out before you come fuck mine up. Because uh, I have mine figured no, out. No, the thing I hate, bro, is Big push-offs. Mocha 2021. Like, when you're playing basketball and a motherfucker push you off, like, like cause you're not really expecting a nigga to push you off, right? Like, cause I'm, I'm making sure not to fucking touch you. So mm-hmm. I, you call foul or something. Yeah, because you be, yeah, because you, when they run in, you got to do this, and yeah. then they push you off, and you keep going this way. And they, Ooh! Yeah, like, nigga, you, this nigga got a strong arm the fuck out of that's me. Why, that's why I put glue on the bottom of my like, shoes. I mean, <laughs> like, fuck no. I have, to, I have, to, I have to. That's why I'm always scraping the bottom of my shits. I'm not, you're not gonna catch me slipping. But I feel like the most, do, I'm not going to that gym no more. The most disrespectful thing, like fuck all the dunks and shit, is the the unseen screen, right? Cause some niggas be running their heart out, right? Cause I be right, I be brick walled. Oh up, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Just, that I, was like that was like me today. Loki, I was defending that one nigga, and then. I just go to my left, and next thing I know, I just ran into some nigga. I was like, oh, my God. I was, yeah, like, I was actually trying to D this nigga up. I wanted to see what he had. But, of course, I had to get fucking yo, yo. hit by a wall real quick that I wasn't expecting. Because like, nobody calls that shit out either. You're playing pickup, no, but nobody. Left, left. Like, yeah, some people that do, but a lot of people don't. Now, see, my problem is I, I can't tell my left and right. <laughs> I can't even get mad because no, no. I don't fucking do that shit. I can't tell my left and right at the time. Like, I, like, I'm like, oh, he's going left. No, that's fucking right. Shut up, nigga. Like, <laughs> like, I'm over here, like you know what I'm saying? I can't, like, double. Well, you have to do it the way, you, if you're looking, so, like, behind me, hey, he's on your left so he's over here on my left no nah, because look i'm looking like this so i'm like oh, well shit, if you're looking at me if you're looking no, at i me gotta use eye. the l trick so i gotta be like okay this is left you know oh, what you saying? just don't know your left from your left yeah like right. I, I have left-handed so that's i don't like, really that's like my, my older sister she don't know her right from her left so when you when you like when she's driving you have to give her direction you have to say up and down because you know how the turn signal is up for right and then down for left yeah i don't know how the hell she passed her driving test well like it's like you really can tell but it just takes extra effort out of nowhere like like, I know my left well, and right, but it's, like, hard to, off the top of the head. I got to be like, oh, left. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I'm not fucking stupid. But, like, I didn't kill it. Like, this awkward science. Like, that. Super fucking, awkward. Yeah, super. This thing, this, this thing, takes this a lot. This guy caught, we were having a conversation. This nigga doze no, off on me. No, I didn't doze off on you. I'm <laughs> looking at the camera because you're, you're talking about Nah, this. nah. It's easy nah, to it's, get mixed up your left and right. It's cool. It's cool. But, no, but that, like I said, my sister, she does that shit. And she doesn't want shit when she's driving. And, like, I don't know how the hell she passed her driver's test to get her license. Yeah, down left, up right. I don't... But you can't say that in the driving test, my yeah. nigga. You can't go... I, I, the driver the driver instructor can't go, Hey, all right, now take a left on this street. You go, um, I'm sorry, what did you say? Yeah, oh, you meant down. down? Yeah, left down. No. That's not how that works. Well, see, like, the thing is, if you can remember... That's not left, how that works. No, look. That's, that's the reason people are bad drivers. If you can remember up left, you can remember left down. Because, look, they say take a right, right? As soon as well, you go up, down... Uh, well, up, up up is right so you already have it wrong well i'm just saying left down you know up right so you're like yeah, but you, you said up left i don't know what the fuck i said brad get off my dick about this well okay? i know what you said guys. if you say left down right you just go oh down and by the time down you turn well. down you're gonna see the arrow that says that way so it's like okay i'm turning this way okay. that's not the, not that's not the point the point is you have to know from when someone says the well, word left not, sir and when someone apparently says the word not, right because she got her driver's license i know she? again which is also questionable because she is an awful driver and she will tell you that too She's, hey, hey. No offense to your sister, but was it a male, uh, you know, instructor? Huh? I said no offense to your sister, but was it a male instructor? I don't know. That was fucking a year. I don't know. That was years ago, <laughs> my nigga. I wasn't with her when she got her license. Like, I'll obviously make it a innuendo. I know, but I don't even know. Said, I would have absolutely no idea. Oh, you look flabbergasted. It's like, <gasps> I, don't, I don't know. Let me think about it. It was 1976. But still, you can't you can't just give out a license to a pretty female just because she's pretty. Nah, if I was an instructor and she was if throwing it, a neck. If you can't drive, get the fuck off no, of the no, road. No. And she was throwing neck and I'm saying like, well. That's like the people that have like well, the nice car. Like people who have nice cars or decent little cars that don't know how to drive piss me off. Because like, why do you have that nice car? You don't even know how to drive. Well, they just go sell they that shit. Work hard or something. Work hard. To, you do all that work just to crash. You do all that work just to... Just to not know your well, life. you, you buy the nicer for car for the safety features and stuff like because you it's suck kinda, at driving. It's kind of hard to die in a Hummer. You know what I'm saying? How about just walk? It's kind of hard to die in that Ford F one fifty. Just Uber. You know what I'm saying? Just walk like a cyber truck. Like you're not you're not killing me. Like I, well, yeah, know? but how many people are riding around with cyber trucks? How many cyber trucks have you seen nice on the cars. How many cyber trucks have you seen on the road, Derek? They're not out yet, so. Yeah, okay. well, there's a lot of Ford F-150s. Oh, actually, there. you want to know what? What about the new Apple car? The, the new Apple car that's coming out in potentially 2025? The, uh, yeah, the, I the, like Apple, did, but Did I'm you see that? It, it has no. no steering wheel? I, I didn't see it, but like I feel like Apple, you're good at designing phones. But yeah, because the car itself is... Like, if you want to say there's ugly. some Apple software in the in the car, yeah, kudos to that. I'm, I'm down for that. But a, a whole Apple car, like... Yeah, it doesn't have a steering wheel. It's completely self-driven. The seat's... Are in, inside they're like facing each other. I think you could twist them around. I think it's just like more like a proof of concept. Like it might, you know, how like uh, Google has this big ass fucking um, like building or whatever headquarters. 
I feel like it's going to be like a, a showcase thing. Like, oh, look what we can do. Because BMW would be doing that shit, too. They be making, like, concept cars and shit. Ones with, like, uh, spherical wheels and shit. But I believe all that shit. Well, no, because they have videos of the cars, like, actually out there on the road. Like, some of, like, the weird-ass cars. Like, I know Mercedes has a car that looks like some futuristic shit with the wheels, like, actually. Yeah, but like, they only spheres. have, like, a certain amount of those. It's not, like, a mass-produced type of thing. Well, yeah, I know. But still, just the fact that they're out there and you could see one on the road is, I think... Pretty fucking cool. I mean, I feel like I'm kind of numb to inventions by now. Like, you feel me? Like, I don't really find, like, new things exciting, like, when it comes to an engineering cool, like, standpoint. Why? Because, like, there's not really much difference, you know? Because the cars could have been, you know, have spherical wheels and shit like that. So I feel like they're not really innovating. They're just crazy shit. Like, you know, he, like... I support Elon and all his shit he does, you know? He makes cool solar panels, you know? He's digging tunnels and shit, making good cars, you know, electric. Yeah, that's cool. But the other shit, these motherfuckers, like the copycats and shit, you know? It's, like, kind of hard to get behind them and what they do. That is true, but, you know, when he, you know, when they see that his his electronic cars are working, then they have to. But this is the Apple one right here. And they even have, I didn't even notice this before, but they have the Apple yeah, logo and the wheel. Hell. It does. It looks really bad. But it doesn't... Oh, I guess it does have a steering wheel. I was seeing things that it said it didn't have a steering wheel. But that's on the right side of the car, so that looks like a European thing. Yeah, fuck them. Yeah. And yeah, okay, yeah, so you can turn the seats and talk to each other. Play cards. You play some... You play some Trump in the car. Nah, nah, you gonna slap this little... <laughs> you gonna slap down that motherfucking ace and the whole car just gonna go off the fucking... Yeah, or you're you gonna hit the wrong, like, button or some shit. And you're like, ah, oh, fuck. Like, shit get heated in space and shit, like... Would you get yourself a Tesla or a self-driving car? Do you trust it enough? Yeah, I don't got Tesla money, though. Well, how much is a Tesla? I heard they weren't really that, uh, that expensive. Like, 32000 I think, for a base model. That wasn't too bad. 29000 used from Carvana. Carvana. Yeah, yeah 32000 That's know? the uh, motherfucking uh, car vending machine. Yeah, but I would get mine new. I'm not getting some, like, old shit. Yeah, no, that's my next car. Well, I, I don't know. Especially not a Tesla. Like, yeah, you got to get a new Tesla. I don't I don't really care about, like, new, new cars. Like, because new, new cars, unless you got, like, the money for them, they're kind of, like, worth, they're kind of not, they're not really worth the money. Asset, so it's like, as soon as you drive it off the lot, it... it by, like, 20000 so. Yeah, immediately, as soon as, as soon as you drive it off the lot, right after you buy it, it sucks. That's like that's like going to GameStop, buying a game, walking out the door, and then trying to return it, and they'll give yeah, you... Yeah, GameStop, oh... Twenty dollars less. No, no. The GameStop will give you fucking ten percent of what the game is cost. Oh, it's a sixty dollar game. How about five dollars? Well, that wow. okay. Well, the math on that didn't add up. How? Because twenty percent of sixty is twelve. I said ten percent. Okay, so ten percent of sixty is six. I said a fifty dollar game. It's five. About? That's what. Red. I literally said GameStop will try to give you ten percent. There'll be a fifty dollar game. And they'd be like, oh, house five. <laughs> you fucking dumbass. No, no, no. Because you want to get all of me about my lesson rights and shit. My lesson rights. But as soon as you say some dumb shit. I am going to get on you from your left and right. Look, Compared to com percentages, uh, yeah. Nah, nigga. You definitely need to know I'd your left and right. I learn my percentages in my left and right. It's like, you got to think about it, right? You can get through life without knowing your lefts and rights that well. But without percentages, you ain't shit, you know? Just give me a price. Oh, I probably should hit shop, shouldn't I? Yeah, you, probably, they... you gotta choose like um, mileage and stuff like that before they'll give you a price. Oh, let me you fuck know. all this. Model X accessories, Model Y. But they have apparel? Yeah, it's Tesla. True. Ooh, this is a nice one. They got you think sun. Elon, mean capital of the world, don't have apparel and cool shit? You know yeah, what I'm saying? Tesla car, that is like, this nigga fucking launched a flamethrower. He just gave it, you know, let people Oh, yeah, buy that it. is. Yeah, that, not, like, what is it called? Not a flamethrower or some shit like that? Yeah, like. Who's do who, who like regulates like you know? I feel like their PR team would just be sweating sometimes. Like oh shit, <laughs> you like you know like when he um did the thing with the stock trade and shit and made his like um made people think he was going private or whatnot, and the motherfuckers were freaking out and shit. And I think Tesla stock like dipped or some shit. I, I feel like you know he got fined for that from the stock people. I feel like when you do shit like that, it's just like oh well. Probably not the best look for you. You know what I'm saying? And like when he smoked for the first time on Joe Rogan and shit, like motherfuckers was freaking out about that. Is that the first time that he smoked? Because I feel like oh, he probably smoked before. Okay, yeah, I was going to say. Yeah, like, I, I mean, I feel like he's, he said he doesn't really smoke, so I feel like it's the first time publicly. But I, I, mean, feel I, feel like, like, I feel like everybody fucking smokes. Yeah, people were making a big deal out of it, you know? Well, yeah, that's because he's a, 
he's you know he's the CEO of a corporation and he's you know it's a multi-billion dollar corporation and you know investors and all that stuff so you have to have a level of professionality a professional a professional public appearance well, which I, really- I feel like is being obviously being um, not not so much questioned but like you nowadays it's very obvious that you don't need to have so much of a a uh, positive yeah. public yeah, perception. profile. So you like just niggas have face tattoos if you work in that fucking house. Yeah, you just have to shit. have a good product nowadays. Damn, the Model S is off a lot more expensive than the other. Why? Why is that? What mm-hmm. if I want a Model S? I can't get a Model S? No, you gotta get the fucking basic model like you a basic bitch. These ones, the Model Ys. Like if your pocket is not good, you can't get a test. Nah, I'm gonna get a Model 3. A Model 3? Yeah. Why don't you get a Roadster or some shit? That's what I was just looking at. What do you mean the Roadster? Yeah, the Roadster. They don't have a Roadster. Uh, I guess talking... they changed the name into it, but... Are you talking about this one? The one that I just looked up? The Model S? I don't know, Brad. I don't... Well, then how... What are you even talking... I can't look at Teslas because I can't afford it, so I don't... I don't know the models and shit. It's like when people... So you're just going to blurt out a model and not even know what it looks like in order for no, me to no, even no. try to know what it is? That's no, what I'm trying to ask it's you. Like, is it this like, one? It's like BMWs you, and you said, Audi. Well, hold on Audi. now. Hold on, because you just said the Tesla Roadster. So yeah. I said... Is it this one? And you said you don't know. So I what the fuck are you talking know, about? Brad, I don't know. So why would you hey, say something if you don't look, even know look, what it look, is? Look, look, hear me out, right? No. <laughs> no. You know what I'm saying? That, so then don't talk about it. Don't, don't, just don't bring it up at all. No, no, no. Because you said, why don't I just get a Roadster? And I said, oh, well, what is that one? The Roadster and then is I look, apparently the better looking, like, the you know, the more aesthetic looking car out of the Tesla fucking models other than the Cybertruck. Okay, so who's where did you see that? Oh, uh, no. M- KHB, who? Marcus Brownlee. I don't know how to his channel. Like motherfuckers be, yeah. See, That's oh, it's not even out yet. I know it's not out yet. Because it's two hundred thousand dollars. Yeah, that's a good looking Tesla. Five thousand like, down gonna today. If you're going to get a Tesla, that's the, the top of the line. Well, yeah, because this is like the supercar of Tesla. Exactly, it looks way better than the Model S. It's not even on here. I know. I don't order know. online for touchless delivery. I can't even or, or afford any of this. Why am I here? Let me go to something I can afford. DollarGeneral.com. <laughs> <laughs> like, have, can you order stuff online from Dollar General? No. It's just careers. Who wants to work at Dollar General? All the, you know, Dollar General workers there. I mean. I'm going to apply. Do you think if I apply here, do you think they would tell my job? Would I get in trouble for that doing live on air if I applied to a different job? No, I applied to no jobs. But, I'm know. not trying to do it seriously. Like, I, bro, I hate going on Indeed and shit like that, bro. Because, like, them fucking niggas will harass the fuck out of you. You know what you got to do? You got to find a job on Craigslist. That's what you got to do. That's how you get the weird jobs. They like, I be listening to these TikTok and shit where they be having, like, you know. So I actually probably should go on Craigslist. Cause they be having, like, sex parties and shit. Like, I want to get invited to one. Mm-hmm. Like, you know what I'm saying? I just want to vibe. Chill. Let's see. What do you think? All right. So, we have for jobs. You have accounting finance, admin office, arc engineering. Art, media, design, biotech, science, business, customer service, education, miscellaneous, oh, definitely this one, et cetera, miscellaneous. Yeah. Paid asthma research study. I have asthma. Let's see what this is all about. I they they don't even give any information about it. Compensation for your time and travel, study related, treatment at no cost, insurance not required. Visitor site to see if I qualify. Let's go check this out. I'm very interested now. I have asthma. Asthma is a condition in which your airways, blah, hey, blah, hey, blah, sir, blah, 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 blah. Everybody sir. knows what asthma is. I don't is. need to hear the technical jargon about I know. That's why I didn't say it. You, you started Everybody, it. Too. I know. And then I stopped immediately, Derek. Jesus you, fucking no, Christ. No, no, Give no, a yeah, I got to put a break. Like, you know what I'm saying? People be doing shit like that. You're like, why didn't you stop me? So when a nigga stop you, you should be like, okay, thank you. Appreciate well, I was already going to stop. So give a nigga a minute. Jesus. Signature gatherer. What is what is any of this? Yeah, it's probably just a research study. They're probably going to have you with different, different, like, different types of pumps and shit. And then see how it affects you and whatnot. But I'm not going to be no focus group big. participation. I need to be on a focus group. You need to be in a fucking mental hospital. Fuck you, you. I need to be. Wait, you got an attention span of a gerbil. You got the the knowledge of a. $75 for two hours of my time. How about that? Yeah, like, nigga, that's not worth your time. It's not. If you give me $400, I would do it. Mm-hmm. It's a yeah. focus group. Where is that? Oh, it's in Fort Lauderdale? Yeah. How about that, too? Yeah, well, you'd be a dumbass if you go all the way out to Fort Lauderdale. Ooh, become a surrogate. Oh, I can't. Just kidding. Never mind. <laughs> 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 you are retarded. Like, bro. Well, with 
that, ladies and gentlemen, this was another great episode of the WTG yeah. podcast. ABC Brad with the, the little moral belly. Yeah. Like, Today I found out I unfortunately cannot become a surrogate mother. But oh, why not, Brad? Cause, why not, Brad? Because the world we why? live in. No, 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 no. The world. Tell me why. I'll tell you why. Biological male. Because I no, no. live in a world today where they do not accept people like us. So, so you're telling me a biological male cannot have a baby boy? Somebody. Or a baby no, girl? No, I'm saying that they, the world I live in does not support somebody like myself who is somebody who just went on Craigslist today and found an ad for surrogacy and for a split second thought I could be a surrogate. But oh, then, but, but why, then, why, why, but why then, you you but then, but then I remembered that I couldn't because I'm not a female. I'm not a, I'm not a woman. So No, 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 no. Why can't you be so a woman? So that's why. So I'm not accepted no, in a world no. where why, I can't. Why can't you be a woman? Huh? Why can't you be a woman? Because I'm not. No. You can identify as it. So I could be a surrogate. Yeah. So if I identify as one, I could be a surrogate? I think that's how it works, right? Well, I just don't think I could have a, uh, I can't have a baby. Why not? Why so not? Regardless of anything, no, it's no, not No, no, why, why not? It's interesting. Why can't you? <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Peace. <laughs>